I'm standing on $180 billion worth of resources and projects for South East Queensland. It's the biggest boom the state will ever and has ever seen. And it won't be knocked off its perch unless Western Australia comes to the table, which will take years. There are 54,000 wells here for liquid natural gas and coal seam gas exploration. The experts say it will take at least 35 years to explore them all. That's a boom with decades up its sleeve, led by some world-class innovations. Chinchilla's demonstration plant is the world's first gas to liquid conversion facility at a cost of $1.2 billion. The Surat Basin is several hours northwest of the Queensland capital, including towns such as Miles, Chinchilla, Dolby, Roma and Wondowan. It's set in an area flush with minerals, oil and resources. It's a region not dependent on any one industry, resource or commodity and there are at least 60 projects in the pipeline here. The Surat Basin holds 20% of Queensland's coal reserves and 65% of its gas. If state government estimates hold true, there are 6.3 billion tonnes of thermal coal here, 565 billion cubic metres of coal seam gas, 6 million barrels of oil and 2.6 million barrels of liquid petroleum gas. I'm at the New Ackland Open Cut Coal Mine that's been operational since 2002 and the fruits of so much labour is clear to see. In fact, there's 500 million tonnes of the black stuff. We're 10 k's north of Oki here, but this coal will go much farther than that. 60% overseas and much of that to China. Coal seam gas and liquid natural gas exploration are strong forces in the Surat Basin economy. Australia is set to become the second largest provider of LNG in the world. The nature of both LNG and CSG projects is that wells need to be maintained for decades. This means that an ongoing economic driver will be management of the sites for many years to come. No one talks millions in Queensland's Surat Basin anymore, but billions. And someday soon, the word trillions may not seem so ridiculous either. There's already $180 billion worth of approved projects on the table for the region. And a town like Miles is well placed to take advantage of many of them, on the corner of the Warrigo and Leichhardt highways. This region has the largest gas project South East Queensland has and will ever see. It's difficult to get a clear picture of what's going on here on the ground, but from the air, the sheer scale of exploration is undeniable. Environmentalists have voiced concerns over an industry reportedly worth billions to the economy. Locals say that if money talks, this kind of money will drown out any opposition.